to Kelly Barlow Creations. If you're new to my channel and you're stopping by for the first time, thank you for stopping by. Welcome to my channel. Stick around a while by clicking that red button for more crafting on a budget, more everything on a budget videos to come. And if you click it again when the bell appears, YouTube should notify you every time I upload a new video, depending on the option that you choose in the drop down menu of the bell. If you're interested in following me on social media, you can find those links, you guessed it, in the description box below. Where am I at today? Yes, I am in Utah and I am with the creator of the Etsy store who does all of the amazing embellishments, hashtag my BFF, Linda here. Yes, super excited. We're going to the Dollar Tree today. We're gonna see what new items Dollar Tree has, what new Christmas items Dollar Tree has, possibly for the upcoming Christmas tier tray that I still need to bring to you. And so I'm excited to see what new items they have and be shopping with my BFF. The best shopper. Yes, it's trouble when we go shopping together. <laughs> is it not? It's, it's the most fun. Yes, and that is exactly why, hence, I need to bring an empty suitcase with me each time I come because it's going to be filled up. I'm a bad influence. Well, last time we had to go shopping for a suitcase. This time I brought one. And so... Oh. We're thinking ahead, thinking yes. ahead, thinking ahead, getting prepared, but I'm excited to see what these stores in Utah has and what items I can be adding to the Christmas tiered tray that she'll be doing the embellishments for. So yeah, I'm going to quit my gabbing and let's go head on into the Dollar let's Tree. Dollar Tree. Yep, let's go. Alrighty, so I am going to start off with some of my... I want to say cool new favorite finds from Dollar Tree. Look at these wall decal stickers that they've got. These are kind of like a puffy sticker. I would say two dimensional, but it's not. It's just a puffy sticker type. I found welcome, I found home. There were some other ones too that I thought were pretty cool, but they just weren't my style. And so I picked up the two that would fit my decor style and maybe I will be incorporating these into a DIY somehow. Seriously? Oh my word. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about these. These are the ceramic figurines that you can DIY. Would you look at the size of this Santa? How awesome are these? Picked up two of these snowmen. How cute are these? Oh my goodness, obsessed. Love this. Oh, but if these two weren't cute enough, wait for it. Yes, they had a truck. So of course I got two. Look at how stinking cute that is. I love these. Yes, I think this is a great new addition by Crafter Square, a fun addition. Who doesn't love to paint and DIY these? I also saw that now Crafter Square has these galvanized tin buckets in a set of three. This is a fun new addition as well. I know in the wedding and party section, they have the white pails, but I am loving that they have these now. You might be seeing these in a farmhouse tiered tray. Kind of obsessed again with all of the Buffalo Check Christmas decor. I know it's old for some people, but it will never get old for me. Loving this snowflake. Nothing else needs to be done to this. It's perfect. I thought this was another really cool find. This is decorative card stock by Crafter Square. It's in the fall and harvest decor style. I'm going to keep my eye open for some Christmas. Didn't see any Halloween. So yeah, I picked up a few packs of these just to put in my cardstock stash as if I don't have enough scrapbooking paper already, right? I found a new print, I guess I'll say, of Dollar Tree's stickable wallpaper, which is pretty cool. What size does this measure out at? Does it say? It is not, oh, 11 by 16. Okay, that's a decent size. And so yeah, I hadn't seen this whitewashed wood print yet. And so I thought that this was fun. This would be something that I could easily add to a DIY instead of scrapbooking paper or fabric. So I picked up a bunch of this. I love adding stickers to my collection. And these kind of reminded me of something that Tim Holtz would come up with. I just love, love, love the style of these. Again, this is one of those things that I have no clue what I'm gonna do with, probably don't even need it, but 
it might find its way onto a paper crafting DIY. And I will be bringing to you a couple of those here in the next couple of weeks. I'm gonna be bringing to you more before Christmas. So that'll be fun. But isn't that gorgeous? I just thought that these were beautiful. For a dollar, you can't beat that. And this really is in no particular order. I was waiting in line and the line was going down the health and beauty aids aisle. And I saw that e.l.f. now has some face masks at Dollar Tree. I found a couple of different ones here. For those of you who don't know and haven't caught on yet, I am mildly obsessed with whitening my teeth. And so when I see new toothbrushes by Colgate that have the charcoal, this is a triple action, soft bristles, cause that is a must. You don't want to ruin your gums. Yeah, you've got the triple action here with the three different bristles and we're getting the charcoal there in the middle, which always helps remove some of those stains. Another great buy for a dollar. I love that Dollar Tree has these flower sack towels. Didn't know if you all knew that, you're getting two for a dollar. It's the holiday season. If you've got a Cricut and you've got heat transfer vinyl, DIY some personalized towels using these flower sack towels because these are amazing. They come out looking pretty high end and anybody who receives them is going to really appreciate and love them. Also saw that Dollar Tree is carrying more of Sally Hansen's nail polish, which is an amazing buy with a great savings. I found these two colors. So of course, you know, I love painting my nails. So I picked them up. Moving on to some of the Christmas decor, which I'm sure other creators have brought to you, but now I'm bringing it to you. Would you look at these tea light holders? They are wire reindeers. Yeah, obsessed, love these. Picked up a couple of these to add to my Christmas decor this year. Found these wood shapes in an angel and a snowman. I thought I picked up a Santa. I could be wrong or I might be showing it to you a little bit later, but you're getting eight of these wood shapes in a pack. How fun are these? These would be really cool to add to a Christmas village of some sort. Along with those other wood shapes, I found these, what they're calling wood shapes as well. You're getting 14 pieces in a pack. Found these stars. You're only getting one size in this pack. It's not different sizes, but I love the fact that they've got stars now. So I picked up several of these. It looks like it is a seasonal item, but when I do flags and whatnot, or farmhouse decor with stars, these are going to be a great addition to that for all year. So if you see these, I'd pick them up. These little gingerbread were just so stinking cute. And of course, we've got some snowflakes as well. I am loving that Crafter Square is adding all these new wood words and wood shapes to their crafting supplies. And so I found this Let It Snow that I am loving. You're getting three in a pack, Believe. And we've got this Merry Christmas banner. How cool are those? When I saw these DIY 3D craft kits, I was so stinking excited. I found several different types. This snowman is super cute. Oh, I guess I picked up two of the gingerbread house. And there's a Santa Claus one. You can expect to be seeing these in one of my DIY series that I bring to you. And so you might wanna pick up a couple if you see them because you're getting a lot of wood items in here for a dollar and it makes for a great kit. Did I say that I'll be using in one of my DIY series videos, I guess, that I'll be bringing to you? Yeah. Okay, I'm sure you all have seen this. When I saw these plaques, you know I had to pick them up. I'll probably DIY them on my own, not in a video, but anything with a truck and this fun little Airstream trailer is just so stinking cute. So this is going to be a set that I DIY. I'll probably DIY it with some puppy paint and regular paint and it's gonna be super cute and it'll be something that I put on my fireplace. How fun are these sleds? I found them in a few different styles. I'm hoping to DIY them this year. Truth be told, I think I'm running short on time if you can believe it already, but I'm gonna try. If not, I'll have them for next year, but I just thought that these were really fun. So I picked up one of each style. And I am seeing that Dollar Tree has this fun little wood toy truck now. 
So this is definitely something you're gonna wanna pick up that you can expect to be seeing on guess what? Yes, the Christmas tiered tray. And I picked up a couple of these felt garlands, the Santa and the snowman, just to kind of add to Allison's room. How fun is that? How, it's six pieces. Is it saying how long it is? 40 inches long. Okay, so that's not bad. Other ornaments that you should keep your eye open for that I will be utilizing this holiday season is the Buffalo Check bows and these ornament tags. Oh my goodness, obsessed with those. How cute are those? And I couldn't resist the birdhouse. Oh my goodness, loving all the buffalo check in the black and white and red and black. The last new item find that I found at Dollar Tree is this pouring medium. For those of you who follow my daughter Kayla, you know that she does a lot of paint pouring. And so sometimes you need a medium to maybe add to the paint, I'm not sure. But yeah, Dollar Tree's got this for a dollar now. And so I picked up a couple for Kayla. So you can expect to be seeing her do a video trying out this pouring medium here real soon. She was taking a break. She's been working a lot at work. They were short on staff. So she's been working like five or six days a week, which equals no time for YouTube videos, but that's okay because she's gonna pick up here real soon again. So you'll wanna stay subscribed and stay tuned for more of her videos to come. On to the Walmart finds that I found that, yes, if I sound like a broken record, these are items that I will be adding to my Christmas decor this year when I saw this. Yeah, enough said, right? I don't even need to explain why I bought this. I love it. And to go with that truck, this adorable travel trailer. Oh my word. Okay, we just need to put them together, don't we? Look at how fun that is. I can't, I can't. Can I just say it again? Enough said. And for that new section in Walmart that is supposed to be somewhat similar to Target's dollar spot stop, whatever it is. Yes, I found this wood ornament. This here was $3. Yeah, you kind of can't beat that. How amazing is that for $3? This tree, again, $3. I don't think I could make this for under $3. This tree, yes, this is at Walmart's dollar spot. One to five dollar spot, still a great buy. They had some fun red truck kitchen towels. How many are you getting in this? How many? Oh, you're getting three for $5. That is not bad, actually. Yeah, three pack for $5. I found several of these fun trucks. These were, can I just tell you? Yes, $1. Mm-hmm, $1. And nothing needs to be done to these. I also found it in green for $1. How cute is that? I love these. I know, I couldn't help it. How cute is that? This is a decent size. I couldn't pass this up or $5. How do you pass that up for $5? You don't, that's why I got it. Alrighty, so I'm gonna say we found some pretty good finds, didn't we? Too much. Yes, too much, but thank goodness I've got that extra piece of luggage and I'm excited to bring you some of these items that will definitely be appearing on the tear tray and in some upcoming holiday Christmas DIYs. Thank you all for joining us for this Dollar Tree haul here in Utah. Always makes for a great time. Please make sure to give this video mm -hmm, a big thumbs up and let's get this video to 5,000 likes because like I always say, and I know I sound like a broken record, but each and every one of your thumbs up and those comments that you do leave, yes, down below. They really do help my channel to grow and it helps YouTube to notice me just a bit more. <laughs> okay. Are we, are we in frame? Yeah, I think okay. so. I'm good there, I'll check you out. Okay. I think we're good. Okay, I'll just okay. squeeze, okay. Your hair sticking up anywhere? No. Okay. Okay, here we go. Hey everybody, welcome back. Start over. I was I was moving off with your hair. I was still messing with your hair. I'm like, I'm ready. I I, 
don't have eyes in back of my head, but that's okay. <laughs> you do today. Right? Okay, ready? Yeah. Okay. Okay, hold on. Don't move. Why? Because I have to do the outro. Should I move sides so it no. looks different? <laughs> No, no, just go with Don't it. Don't put these outtakes in there this time. Hold oh. on, I'm gonna switch my legs so it looks a little different. Okay. <laughs> You're <laughs> So we don't look like we just sat here 30 we seconds you later. Did drop down menu the moment. <laughs> That's awesome. I love it. There were a couple. I was like, perfect. I didn't even see you because I can't, I don't have the viewfinder. I know, it's really great. <laughs> oh, goodness, that would be a good one. Okay, I'm ready. Ready? I'm never ready, but I'm ready. So just go with it. <laughs> Thank you all for sitting with us while we... No. 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 <laughs> okay. Thank you all. There we go. Start yep. there. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> Are we contemplating what we're going to say? Yeah. Hold on. What's the vibe? We're waiting. I'm not sure yet. Joining us. Yes. Until next time, everybody. I hope you have a... <clears throat> Until next time, everybody, I hope you have a fantastic day. <coughs> Goodness me. We'll get through it. I promise. Yeah. Until next time, everybody, I hope you have a fantastic day. Happy crafting on a budget. Happy everything on a budget. Stay happy, stay safe, stay healthy, but most of all, stay positive, please, because I am. Bye for now, everybody. Thanks for having me. <laughs> I'm doing all these gestures with you. <laughs> You're such a dork. Okay, we're done. <laughs> Thank you.